before we get into this video, please subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification button and please like this video as well. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you what I bought in Liverpool because I did go away with my boyfriend Scott to Liverpool as a birthday surprise for my birthday weekend and I do do a little bit of damage shopping honestly if you take me somewhere that sells the makeup and clothes most likely i will probably ruin my bank balance and that is what i did during my birthday honestly i had such an amazing time in liverpool the shopping there can i just say is amazing like i did buy quite a, a good few things and i'm super happy like everywhere I had sales on as well by the way um, and honestly i just had such a great time shopping with scott and it was just amazing um I do have quite a few bags with things to show you and I'm honestly so excited so without further ado let's get on with the so video. So the first shop I went into was H&M and I did actually buy a clothing item. Um, oh my god the H&M in Liverpool by the way was amazing like I was honestly amazed but I did buy a pink cable knit jumper this was 24 however as I was a H&M member I did get it for like 22 pound something but this is like a gorgeous pink cable knit jumper i have seen it a few times that i've been in h m and i thought i'll get it because i do need to get some new clothes like a lot of my clothes in my wardrobe are very old i've had them for a good few years and there are a lot of clothes in there that i would not wear so i did decide to get a jumper because it is colder now and it is a lovely new jumper which i will wear a lot definitely oh my god it's so thick and i cannot wait to wear this so i got this from h m and it's so and it's such a beautiful colour. Honestly, the clothes in H&M at the minute, especially the jumpers, are amazing. Um, I will have to go in H&M again because... Oh no, but it'd be locked down. I'll have to order online. I just realised. Guys, can you believe we're going to another lockdown again? Like, what the hell is going on? I honestly... I'm, I'm, I'm not happy. I'm really not happy. Then, I did go into Topshop and I did buy a doll highlighter because I have seen their highlighters before and I've just thought wow um, I was after a new highlighter because I do currently have an Urban Decay one but it's kind of like hit pan and I hardly have any left so I thought it was time to get a highlighter it is the Dove Beauty one firstly the packaging is gorgeous I did get it, I did get this in Topshop for £15 but yeah it's beautiful just comes in like some, some bubble wrap it's gorgeous it's pink and it's gold with a heart it says doll light are you ready to see the beauty? Oh my god! <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Look at it. Look how gorgeous it is. There is a mirror there actually. I'll hopefully it won't blind you all. It's beautiful. Look at that beauty. It is amazing. And in the mirror it says make them stare. Oh my god, I cannot wait to use this. It's so pretty, it's so glittery, and it is the lighter highlighter because I do have very fair skin. But oh my god, it is so good for £15. Um because like it's like a great size and it's perfect for putting in your makeup bag as well so i did get that and i did do some damage in morphe here's my bag so at the minute morphe do have a massive sale on like a lot of the makeup's half price well i think the lipstick's are half price and i think they're actually selling off the jeffree star eyeshadow palette for 14 pounds so if you want to have a look online because i think the day i upload this video will be in lockdown unfortunately so yeah um I hope you're all coping okay in lockdown. If you ever need a message, message me. Instagram is alice.holmes underscore. You can always give me a message. I always reply to you guys. But I did go in Morphe. I did do, I did do a bit of damage in there. The only reason is, is because I do not have a Morphe shop where I live. So I might as well make the most of it when I don't have one near me. Do you know what I mean? It's my logic anyway. So firstly, I did get a beautiful beautiful palette it is the morphe 35 xo this is the natural flirt one it's got 35 shades in here this was at the front of the shop when you walked in and oh my god i was almost drooling and i'm not gonna lie the packaging is beautiful it's gonna take it out i think i've only opened this once look at the packaging first it's gorgeous then here is the beauty i'm just gonna slowly take the seal off but here it is look how gorgeous this palette is I'm just going to show you it. it. It has got lots of lovely, neutral, pretty pink and brown and purple shades in here. And a lovely glitter as well, which I cannot actually wait to use. It's called 
crushing hard. I can't wait to use that, but I bought this because there are a lot of everyday colours in here and you may ask me, Alice, you do have quite a lot of eyeshadow palettes. Yeah, that's right. A lot of my eyeshadow palettes are quite neutral colours, but I could not resist. Honestly, I do not know where to put this. My eyeshadow drawer will not close pretty much. I've got to like move eyeshadow palettes in different drawers, which is quite bad. So I don't actually have a home for this palette at the minute, but I just thought, just go for it, buy it. Like, I'm only 19 for 365 days and this is my 19th birthday, so I might as well just go for it. So I did. I've got it and it was £24 which I think is pretty good because Morphe eyeshadows are like amazing so I was pretty happy to get this. I love Morphe eyeshadow palettes. This is like my fourth Morphe palette now but it's so worth it. Like they last so long as well. So I got that and then in the Morphe shop I did pick up quite a few lip products because I wanted to make the most of the like £2 lip liners. Literally they were selling off all the lip liners for £2 which I thought was amazing. So I actually sort of with these two lip liners which I got. I did get quite a few lip liners um, but the only thing is right in Primark I used to buy all the pencil lip liners however now the lip liners in Primark are like the pen ones so you can't actually like sharpen them which is really bad um, but anyway I did get three lip liners so firstly I did get one in well red which is actually just like a red lip liner um, I do like a red lip liner so I did get that one and it was only £2 so I was like wow it's gone in a basket I did get one in Crush which is like a brownie ready colour and I did get one in Frenchie which is just like a lovely nude colour so I am happy to be topped up on lip liners because no word of a lie all of my lip liners in my drawer are literally like this big so it was definitely time to get some fresh new ones and I certainly did stock up for a while um, I will have to have a look online actually because I do want to get some more colours I'm kind of addicted to lip liners at the minute I'm a weirdo, I know, sorry. And then I did actually get a red lipstick in Independent. Um, I do actually have a red Morphe lipstick. It's called Lover, I think. And I do love Morphe lipstick. Like, they are so good. This is a matte one. Um, I'm just going to open it because the packaging is actually really nice. I haven't actually opened any of my lipsticks or the planners, so I'm hoping that no one has, like, used them. I do have the receipt, but obviously I don't live in um, Liverpool, so... Look at that colour, oh my god. Also, all the lipsticks were half price, so they were £6. Um, what a bargain though, look how beautiful that is. Honestly, I will sound like a weirdo, I do like the smell of new lipsticks. This one doesn't seem to have a smell though. No, but, oh my god, look at pew pew. Look, look at that lovely, I can't speak. Look at this lovely lipstick, it actually has M engraved, which I think is so cute. This is like such a classic colour. I do actually suit red lipstick, which I'm quite happy about to be honest, because like it's like it's like a really sexy colour isn't it and I love it I just love red lipsticks and then I did actually get two glosses because the glosses were actually like £4.16 £4.16 each so I did get two I did get one in Trippy and one in Froze so I'm going to open Trippy first this one's like a darker red which I don't actually have dark red glosses so oh wait a minute this is like completely different to what I thought it was going to be it's like a how do I describe this it's like it does not look anything like the colour on there. How do, how do they look the same colour? It's like a glittery kind of lip gloss. I wonder if this... Hmm. It's like a brownie colour, which I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. I actually wonder if this, lip, if this lip gloss turns to like a dark red when you put it on your lips. I actually want to know. I want to know the answer to that, but I will wear this colour. It's kind of like really glittery though, but... I'll vibe with it, I'm sure. And then I did actually get another one in Rose, in Frosé, I mean, isn't Rosé. I do need some Rosé right now. <laughs> but it's like a lovely nude colour, I'm hoping. Oh my god, imagine if I open this one, it's like a, a bright red. I won't be surprised. Oh, it's really cute. Oh my god, oh my, right, so these two are the same colour. I'm really confused as to why the other one was a different colour, but you know, it's fine. Um, this one is like a lovely pinky nude. I'm going to see if this one smells nice because honestly I'm such a weirdo, I, I apologise. Oh, now that smells lovely. This is like a lovely shiny glittery gloss. I do actually wear like clear pink glittery glosses like over lip liner. I think it's such a cute little look. So I did get that for £4.16 as well. Honestly, Morphe are honestly winning with the sales at the minute. I did get 
all this makeup discounted and I did get this gorgeous palette for £24. They, they were going straight in my basket. If you want to go to Morphe, get there before Wednesday because otherwise you won't be able to go. And there probably won't be any sales online either but it's worth having a look. But oh my god, look at all these beauties that I've got. Obsessed. And next I got um, a visor. Scott surprised me with a girl golf and we were able to buy these visors for like three pounds and oh my god these are so cool to wear on the course and um, i will actually insert a few photos of like the get all golf now because like it was so cool i'll put them like around the screen somewhere but oh my god it's so cool like i think you have to be 18 or over to go but like it's so worth it like if you are 18 you need to definitely go like it's such a cool experience like and if you like golf like it's so fun or even if you're not as keen on golf, like you should definitely go. Like it's such a fun thing to do. Um, but yeah, but these visors are super cool. I actually wore them around the course. Of, like look at that. It's like a lovely purple colour. I just go like that with the golf. Ooh. <laughs> Honestly, I think I lost the game of golf. I think I did. Yeah, I did actually. I was a very sore loser as well. <laughs> um, and then the final shop I went into was TK Maxx. And the final thing here is a present for Scott. Um, he obviously did see them and he knows I bought them and he knows that I bought him them for Christmas but the only reason is it's because Scott is a size 12 um, I bought him a pair of slippers by the way I've got to mention that sorry um, Scott has very big feet he's a size 12 and I've been looking for slippers for Christmas for him everywhere um, because he asked for them for Christmas so I was like right I'll get you a pair of slippers I could not find a size 12 anywhere, they were all, they were all like a 10 to 11 um, and I think a 10 to 11 would not fit his big feet but we did actually find a one pair, I'm not even joking, there was one pair of 11 to 12 and he actually re really liked them as well, these are sheep skin slippers, they're made in England, they're really nice, they're so soft inside and they're really fancy, they're worth £30 which I think is a lot but Scott's worth it, you know what I mean, he deserves these lovely slippers, they are kind of like a greeny grey colour which I really like, they're really cool but yeah, I got them in TK Maxx and if any of you guys are struggling to find your boyfriend's slippers in like a size 12, I recommend TK Maxx because firstly they're really good quality and most likely you will find bigger sizes probably um but yeah these are lovely and i'm sure he will wear them a lot one more thing that i forgot oh sorry in superdrug at the minute they literally have like buy one get one half price kind of like deals on and just like all sorts of deals on so i did actually buy two sponges i think one was 2.49 or you could buy two for three pound 30 so of course i had to get two sponges these are the be blending sponge latex free i have had some of these before and they're really good so i did get two of them but here is the end of my shopping haul honestly i did spend quite a bit of money but it is worth it like i literally love everything i bought i know that most of it is makeup but you know you know what i'm like i do love my makeup and if you let me loose in the makeup shops most likely i will just break my bank account which is pretty normal for me to do to be honest but i really hope that you guys have enjoyed this video if you have you know what to do make sure to leave a thumbs up a comment down below and please also subscribe to my channel as well and i will see you all in my next video bye everybody